Damn, my posture sucks. It looks like I took a flying round kick to the left side of my head. Head is all shifted over to the right. Look at my hips, I got one higher than the other. Looks like I got one leg longer than the other. It looks like somebody took a big chunk out of my right arm. I think that's the green screen. So as a part of my multi-layered rebuild, becoming a stronger version of my 44-year-old self, posture is gonna have to do a lot with it. I'm gonna be building core strength, building functional strength, the way my posture looks is gonna change as well. So I figured this would be a good place to start. And sideways ain't much better. Looks like my ankles are where they're supposed to be, but immediately the knees shift forward, the hips shift forward. My shoulder is the only thing that is where it belongs. And I think that might actually be a compensation or a problem. Uh, and of course my head is falling forward. So what am I supposed to do about all this? Well, that's the point of this video. And I just bought this app that's supposed to be able to screen my posture. Let's see, look at that guy, he's moving and it's got little spots to track my joints. It's got all kinds of buttons that you can push and fancy things that it does. Let's see, yep. Even movement assessments and check this guy out. He's got real problems and her, boy, her head's falling off. So these people definitely need this. I definitely need this. Forgot to mention that I have no business dealings whatsoever with this app. In fact, it's like 50 bucks and I'm on a 30 day trial. So if I use it, I'll let you know. If I don't, well, no worries, bro. So this is the official diagnosis, the analysis based on the app. And so my head is shifted to the right. Uh, my shoulders, they're tilted. Rib cages shifted, hips are shifted. Q angle on the left and the right are different. And so based on physics, my head now effectively weighs 32 pounds instead of 16 pounds. My shoulders are shifted, my hips are shifted, my knees are shifted, I'm a mess. So let me talk a little bit about my goals. First of all, that's what Yo Elliot looked like when he was 23 years old. And I don't know if my posture was much better then. It looks like my head is still tilted off to the right. So this is probably due to a structural issue. I know it is, in fact. Um, I have an imbalance in my pubic symphysis. So basically the bone at the bottom of your hips are supposed to come together like this. Mine come together like that. They're like my bones are imbalanced. So I've been kind of having this my whole life. Even when I was in kindergarten, I had muscular imbalances. So I'm gonna do the best that I can with what I got. But I also want to use this as an opportunity to look at some ideal versions of old Uncle Yo when he was not so old. And so this is when most of y'all came to know me, probably about 2012-ish, 2013 on YouTube. So let's talk a little bit about my goals. Of course, I'm not planning on ever becoming one I once was. That's sort of impossible. Um, I got a lot more wisdom now. But I've got a hell of a lot more injuries than I did back then. Good thing, during those days, I spent a lot of time studying rehab, uh, corrective exercise, rehabilitating injuries, and correcting posture. I spent a lot of my time and money studying with Paul Check when I was, in, uh, when I was a young trainer. And so I know what I need to do in order to get back there. But along the way, I'm pretty sure there'll be some innovations. I'm going to be reading new books, studying with new experts and learning new things as I rebuild myself back up so that you know that it's never too late to rebuild back too. So here are my four main goals, broad goals, the things we'll be approaching over the course of the next few months as you follow me back to not only strongman competition, but also being my most charismatic, YouTube-friendly, ting, Elliot Hulse, right? And over the course of the past few years, you guys have seen me in many different incarnations. This is just a new one that I'm uh, kind of coming full circle to. So goal number one, pain-free posture. And it's not that I'm in a lot of pain, but I just don't move as well as I did, say, 10, 20 years ago, obviously. But pain-free posture means that I can do what I need to do and I never have to stop and stretch a bunch in order to do it well. Moving like a limber monster with no pain or restrictions at all. Number two, functional strength. So I take it from my studies with Paul Check. That means flexibility, stability, strength, and power. And of course, it all begins at the core. So when I say functional strength, I mean core strength first. 
So there'll be exercises and stretches and mobility movements that I'll use in order to support functional strength in my core, not just bracing strength or six pack strength, but movement strength. Uh, that's going to be coupled with mobility. So that's a part of it. So it was power because I'm doing straw man. I made a commitment to be a master's level straw man. So I'm going to be throwing heavy weights up over my head and tossing sandbags over 15 foot, foot poles and picking up heavy things from the ground and being a functional straw man. So I'm going to need that power and then work the breathing into it. So uh, with all these muscular imbalances, my breathing patterns have suffered 100%. And it changes the way I am. Well, you are a breathing mechanism. And so the way you breathe is going to change your character, your character structure. I'm not going to get too far down that rabbit hole in this video, but you heard me talking about it in the past. I'm aiming to maximize my full self-expression given my physical limitations and gifts, right? And so that's the bioenergetic aspect of it. We'll be exploring that. And then I guess you could say the health and aesthetic aspect of it, right? Looking and feeling good is I got about 15 pounds to lose. I want to stay lean. I want to be lean under, under 200. Uh, and we'll see what the belly button looks like then. So this is a healthy version of Yo Elliot's waist. So I'm thinking I can get back there somewhere. That's not unreasonable for me. And here's me looking a little bit more big waisted, but also a little bit more jacked. So I'd like to be somewhere in between. We'll see. Anyway, so y'all gonna be following me as I vlog my way through this whole journey. We'll be making anywhere between three and five videos a week where you'll see how I'm adjusting my lifestyle, how I'm doing my diet, how I'm training and how I'm thinking, what I'm reading, what I'm learning and my general journey towards fixing my posture, being my strongest self, competing in strongman, getting lean and ripped, and letting that charisma exude through this camera. So I hope you enjoy this. I'll talk to you next time. Done, dude.